All right, guys, we are out on the pond and I am going to map the bottom contours. This is an old unit. I think it's an HD, well, there it is, an Elite 5 HDI. You can log your sonar. And I'm gonna start logging. Well, And here, I've got this red light flashing up here. That means I'm recording. So I'm gonna log the contours and send that in to uh, Lawrence. I think it's a, uh, what are they? It used to be Insight Genesis. It's something different now. But as I paddle around, float around, and uh, I'll go back and forth each direction to kind of get cross sections and get a good, get a good map of the bottom, send that in, and they'll generate a, uh, a one inch contour map and I'll know exactly where all the structure is and where to fish. So after all that paddling, this is what my track looked like. It was about two hours worth. It's probably more than the team at CMAP Genesis needs. And by the way, they were great. Ian in, in customer service there helped me through how to get this installed back onto my Lowrance unit. Um, super helpful. Check out CMAP Genesis. And with that, they produced this contour map. It's just like a contour map that you would pay to have loaded onto your, onto your whatever your unit is, whether it's Lowrance or Hummingbird or Garmin. Um, the Lowrance team produced this map for me of our very own backyard pond. And so I'm going to go around and put waypoints where all the structure and uh, PVC structures and the brush piles and culverts and where the diffusers are. Um, it's gonna, just going to be super helpful. And so, highly recommend this. Um, we got our very own contour map of our backyard pond.